was a few. With my money. And I lost I missed the other time. part. I'm so mad I didn't hit record. What? The sun <laughs> stopped shining. <laughs> Everything else. It rained <laughs> all the time. <laughs> Did set me back some. I know. Like like but I'll never I get old. Uh, <laughs> Do you know how much you mean to me? Should have told you, cause it's true. I get old. Losing anything, but I'll never get over When you're young and there's time, you forget the past. You don't think that you will, but you do. Well, I know. Right now I don't have time enough And I'll never get over losing you Alright, I'll start with this one. What does this stuff mean to you and why do you do it? I've been cold. I don't really know hungry. why I did the stuff I did as a kid. Not for but it while. stuck with me till this day. I guess so most of my something. dreams how it's just really fun and interesting to me. With it all be around me, no peace do I find, cause I'll never get over losing. A good example of how the documentary will work, remember the Rock of Fire Explosion documentary, that's how it's going to be. Yeah. That's exactly how I want it to be. What, what would you think? What do you think about that? Yeah. Honestly, we are we are the other opposite side of that fan base, really. If you think about it, we're, mm-hmm. we're we, you know, we both we both grew up with this stuff, and they grew up with the Rockfire Explosion. So there's no reason why we shouldn't make a documentary just like that. And the communities are just as big. And who else is going to do a documentary if we don't? Because no one, well, no one knows how to do it. No one knows what to say, and no one's had the experience. And, and they weren't, so, they weren't born when the stuff was starting. We were born right when it exactly started. Exactly, a large percentage of our fan base was not born. So when you look at the Rock Fire Explosion documentary, if you watch it again, just picture us in place of that, talking about the Jimmy stuff, and the history about it. Mm-hmm. 2007 was already 10 years ago. It. It, that's whole that's like holy fuck. It, in two thousand seven I was in second or third third grade. I was I was in fourth I was in fourth grade. I Oh actually no, I think I had just went into fifth grade. Never mind, yeah. Yeah, I was in I think I was in I think I was in second to third grade, maybe third, I don't know. And then all I remember from that year is going to Bed Bath and Beyond and buying that laughing scary skull and then going to, to Michael's and seeing all their stuff and being scared to death by Dawn of the Dead. I remember so many things from that year. It's just crazy. Yeah. Anyway, but um, whenever you're ready, just let me know. You want to know something? Sure. I've been recording for two minutes. I recorded this con- this little conversation. This can be a little sneak peek. Good. Of what's coming up. Do you want to hear it? Yeah, sure. Okay.